Storms. Today we have our bucket of army men. Because I had to play Halo. <laughs> so today we're going to do the battle in my dad's office at our house. Yeah, it's not really an office. It's a room that we put all of our toys. It's really a small room, so it's kind of a tight fit. Yeah. But we make it work, huh? Yeah. Evan has the green team. His dad has the tan team. Yeah, we're scattered out. But Storm, I have a secret weapon, and look what it is. It's, it's a dinosaur from Jurassic World. <laughs> uh, your secret weapon is a dinosaur? Yeah. What kind of dinosaur is that? Stegosaurus. Stegosaurus? Yeah, it's going to take out all your Oh no. <laughs> okay, Evan, so here's the rule of the game, okay? Yep. This is your side, yeah. the green side, and this is the tan side. Yeah. And Whoever gets control of the mountain wins. That's right. So both sides are going to try to gain control of Danger Mountain. I have two jets. So I have an F-14 Tomcat and F-15 Eagle. You mean like Tomcat from Mouse and Jerry, so? <laughs> you mean Tom and Jerry? <laughs> yeah. Oh. So what is your secret weapon? My secret weapon is my tank, and it's going to take down your futuristic jet fighters from Halo 3. Uh, you have an M4A patent tank, so make sure all your guys put their weapons on stun mode. Stun mode? It's a stun mode, okay? This is a friendly game.
Yeah, the green team won. Mm, old Santa had Hey, Evan. Hey, Daddy. Hey, what are you doing, buddy? I'm just playing with my gunship. Oh, is that a Timmy toy gunship? Yep. AC-130, huh? I have something I want you to show the Stormers today. <gasps> is it a Timmy toy gunship? <laughs> Another one? No, we already have two gunships. Maybe a Timmy toy carrier? I'm not sure if Timmy Toys makes a carrier. Today, we are going to show the Stormers the Timmy Toy bucket of army men. Yeah! How about we open up the bucket and see what's inside of it? Yeah! This is the Timmy Toys bucket of army men. 54 piece set. It contains 48 soldiers, a mountain, two flags, two jets, and a tank. Hey Evan, check it out. This is also made in the United States. Yeah. I know. There's the Timmy Toy logo. Hey Evan, did you know that the Timmy Toys Plastic Army Men are in the National Toy Hall of Fame? No. Yeah, they're in a toy museum. That's how famous they are. Is there a toy museum? There is a toy museum. So Stormers, usually there is two armies, the tan and the green. So you have the green army team and you also have the tan army team. So you have both armies inside the bucket. Let's look at the different kinds of soldiers. Up first we have the officers. Yep. There's two tan officers and two green officers. And they're holding a handgun and a set of binoculars. Up next, we have the flamethrowers. Next, we have the landminers. What do they do, Evan? So they scan for landmines. That's right, so nobody steps on a landmine. They, they scan for buried landmines and keep everybody safe, huh? Yep. Up next, we have the radio operators. Evan, what do the radio operators do? The radio operators do things like call in air support, call in tanks and positions, and, and call in for reinforcement. Up next are the mortars. These guys fire 60 millimeter mortar rounds. And these guys are the bayonet fighters. The bayonets are knives or blades on the ends of their rifles. These soldiers are the standing riflemen. They're actually waving on to their fellow soldiers. They're saying, let's go, let's go, let's go this way. Okay, we're saving the best for last. These soldiers are on the ground. These are the crawling soldiers. They're crawling on the ground, trying to keep low, staying out of enemy fire. These soldiers are called prone riflemen. They're laying on their stomachs and they have the rifles in their hand and they're aiming. They could also be snipers. These soldiers are called kneeling riflemen. They're resting on their knee trying to keep their rifle nice and steady. Up next we have the light machine gunners. And the last soldiers, these are the bazooka men. These might be the most famous Timmy plastic army men. And the green team has a secret weapon. It's the M48 Patton tank. The turret moves all the way around. The tan team also has secret weapons and this is one of them. Yep. It's a jet. Yep. This one is actually the F-14 Tomcat. Like the Tom, the Cat, and Mouse and Jerry. Look at the detailing on this thing. Yeah. It's just like the the real F-14. And yeah. it has the missiles on the yeah. bottom. But that one does have... And then there's another one, Evan. The Eagle. You're right. This is the Eagle. This is the F-15 Eagle. Yeah, and 
It has two bombs on the bottom. And it has some missiles on the bottom as well. These are the Tan Team secret weapon. Okay, and Evan, there's something else that came in the bucket. Yep, it's the <laughs> big... It's a mountain. Yep. And this is Danger Mountain. It has four different ledges. There's one on the bottom. Yeah. That's one. And then one right there is two. And then on the side is three. And, and then, then there's another four. one. And then five. Yeah, you can probably put guys on the top too, huh, Evan? Yeah. That's pretty cool. And the last two things that come with the bucket of army men are the they... flags. Yep. Okay, and hey, Evan, it also came with a sticker sheet too. So okay. we actually already took off some stickers, didn't we? Yeah, yeah. Sissy ate that one. Whoa, Sissy ate them? Yeah. I didn't know that. <laughs> that happened when we was playing Halo. Oh. Hey, let's put the stickers on the jets, okay? Yeah. Okay, Evan, let's put the stickers on the mountain next.